Israel's military is building up forces on the border with Gaza with growing signs that a ground offensive may be imminent. At least 119 Palestinians and nine Israelis have died since Monday. CBS's Ian Lee has the latest on the conflict from London. Israel's military called up more than 9,000 extra troops poised along the border with Gaza for a potential ground invasion. In the last 24 hours, dozens of Israeli airstrikes have pummeled the densely populated Palestinian territory, the bloodiest bombardment so far in Gaza. On the ground, hundreds of artillery and tank shells targeted what Israeli officials say are Hamas tunnels. Thousands of Palestinian families fled the assault taking only what they could carry, hoping UN schools provide some safety. Bombs kept dropping and our children kept screaming, this woman says. When we left, everything behind us was destroyed. Israeli officials say the strikes are in response to nearly 2,000 rockets fired by Palestinian militants since Monday. One smashed into this home in the Israeli city of Ashkelon. She says, we heard screaming. Luckily, my family made it into the bomb shelter, but our whole house was destroyed. Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu says Israel is fighting a campaign on two fronts. The first in Gaza, the second in Israeli cities. Police are struggling to control violent Jewish and Arab mobs as unrest threatens to engulf the country. Ian Lee, CBS News.